Tonight, the Devils took on their rivals from across the Hudson River, but sadly, they could not repeat their performance from their last meeting as they fell 3-2 to the New York Rangers. This game was full of action and grit, and though the Devils were missing a few key players, they fought right to the very end. It was clear from the start that the Devils were not going to go down without a fight, and they took that both literally and figuratively. There was a huge scrap between Igor Sharangovich and Braden Schneider after Schneider delivered a hit on Boquist that resulted in a flurry of penalties. This fight occurred only a few minutes into the first period, and Igor received two minutes for instigation, five minutes for fighting, and a 10-minute misconduct penalty, while Schneider received only five for fighting. This tilt came just a few minutes after Sharon Govich scored the Devils' only goal of the game, and he was unassisted in that tally. In the post-game press conference, Coach Ruff was asked about what it means to see his teammates come to each other's defense. Here is what he had to say about tonight's major fight and the way his team has stood up for each other, both in this game and on Sunday. You know, initially when you take a look at it, you think, hmm, it's bad. Um, you know, it's like uh, they're, them coming to their defense on PK's hit. There's no different. It's what this league is about. It's about teammates sticking up for teammates. Uh, I don't want to lose players, um, and sometimes you don't even fight in that circumstance, but it's just it's being there for your teammate. And if you want to build a team that's, that grows together and, and plays together and scores together and fights together and, and looks after each other, some of that happens. Though he is proud of his teammates rallying for each other, this does not come without risks. Sharon Govich never returned to the ice after that penalty, even though his time had expired. Ruff said that he will be evaluated tomorrow and then further action will be taken if necessary. He is just one of the multiple Devils players injured recently as Jimmy VC went down in the second period and had to be helped off the ice by a trainer, not putting any weight on his left leg as he exited. Also during the course of this game, it was announced that young superstar Jack Hughes will not be returning to the ice this season in a Devils uniform, as he suffered a sprain on his left MCL in Sunday's game and will need to rehab through the rest of the regular season. This unfortunate series of events is just the latest in bad news for the New Jersey team, and tonight's matchup loss did not help. After Sharon Govich scored in the first, the Rangers were able to tie it up with a goal from Ryan Strom and then take the lead with a goal from Chris Kreider, both of those occurring on the power play. This game was then scoreless until the third period when Justin Braun finds the back of the net and brings us to our final score of 3-1. to one. Gorgiev looked really solid in net for the Broadway Blue Shirts and their defense was absolutely relentless. As the Devil season is winding down, after today they only have five more home games before saying goodbye to everybody until the fall. They next play on Thursday against the Montreal Canadiens in New Jersey at 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. But until next time, for WFUV Sports, I'm Samantha Bohr.